guys. So please follow me and I will introduce you the new or you can see the better solutions for our LDN. It is called Rapid LDN. Please come here. So you can see. Right now I'm using media converter as the OLT. So after the OLT you can see we will transfer the digital signal to the optical signal here and the optical signal will go here and come to our G-POM service the G-POM service is the first one is a 1 to 8 splitters I have to say one thing right now I'm using patch code to ask the drop cables so it is not correct in this application but this is only for representations so you can see this is, there is 1 to 8 splitters inside so the 1 to 8 splitters inside in these optical splitter boxes this is the first layer splitting which means the digital and optical signal here will be transferred or divided into eight so, uh, eight ways so one of it will go to the second one which means a fiber access terminal follow this line please so you can see because the first box is and the second boxes may have some distance so we will use something to storage the fiber cable so this is a fiber cable storage bracket okay in some cases you will storage like five meters ten meters or whatever and also this fiber bracket can be used with these boxes these optical splitter boxes and also our fiber access terminal so let's keep following the line the line will come here so this part FAT has 10 ports 10 ports means 10 ports means it can hold two pieces of 1 to 4 uh, uh, or 1 to 8 I mean one piece of, well, of 1 to 8 or one piece of 1 to 9 so let's keep following the line so once it's connected it will go directly to subscribers here it is follow the line come here you see these holders yes then if this is clear fiber socket the clear fiber socket is mainly used in FTTR's project it is mainly used in FTTR project okay for the FTTR project it we have several ONUs for example if you're using FTTR project it will have the mother ONU or ONT and after that these mother ONT were contacted to the FTTR socket here it is the FTTR socket have different ports five ports one two four one two four oh, sorry one two five then these optic output will go to the substory ONT so this is a typical FTTR uh, project so after that if you don't have the FTTR project, you are using this and get to spliced in this ordinary fiber outlet. Then, using patch cord to connect it with your soul, which means the only one ONT, ONU. So, you can see by these solutions, all we need to do is to plug and play black and play so you can see we don't need splicing or we only need a few splicing which means we will save time we will no need to train our engineers okay we don't need to hire and pay salary sorry pay higher salary to our engineers it will save time and make the installation to be much easier so that's all thank you so, I just want to explain more about this. You can see, these four are the same connectors. These four are different connectors, which means our boxes has many solutions for you. If you are using uh, A company's connectors, we'll be able to provide it. B company's connectors will also be able to connect or provide to you even C, D, E. So, whatever you need, 
we have that suitable solution for you. So that's all.